I think that one of the things that's causing this funk that people are in is that we're living our lives in these very unfulfilling ways. One of the reasons why these people have this deep-seated anger and resentment is there's a bunch of people that are working all day long doing something that is deeply unsatisfying and, and almost painful. They're stuck in traffic all day and then they're stuck in a cubicle after that. They get in traffic on the way home. They get home after that, they're watching television and they're fucked. We're supposed to be out in the fields. We're supposed to be walking up hills. We're supposed to be looking for animals or gathering vegetables. We're supposed to be doing all these things that our body's designed to do. We're supposed to be in nature. And nature is like a medicine. Like it literally is a medicine to you. You don't have to go hunting. You don't have to go fishing. Just go fucking hike, man. Just go hike up to the top of a mountain and look out. You know, there's a reward that you get from that that is intensely like soul filling. We are making a mistake with the way we live our lives. There are a lot of people that are trying to get rich because they think that once they get rich, they'll be happy. They think that that's gonna give them this thing that they've always been missing. And so they've been working hard, busting their ass, and your life is just about upping the ante, and now I gotta get a yacht, now I gotta buy an island. You know, and trying to find something to fill that void because you've sort of set your life up to chase these material goals instead of to try to find out what actually does make you happy. The pressure to, to succeed, the hustle and bustle that people have is not counterbalanced. We appreciate a person who sleeps three hours a night and fucking is just hustling all day long, constantly hustling, hustling. There's something to hard work and hustle, but man, I think it should be counterbalanced. Look, I'm a, as go, go, go as anybody, but I'm learning as I get older. You can't like be checking your phone and checking your Twitter and checking your email. You gotta just somehow or another figure out a way to let go. And a lot of times we think the most important thing is like financial success. The most important thing is this or that. But that's all bullshit. Clearly your base has gotta be matters of the heart. Understanding that loving each other, brothers and sisters and friends and community has massive benefits and you feel connected to each other and it is the right way to be the best things in life are connected to love. And there's a beauty in that that is magical. <laughs>